Right, an experiment to cut down light pollution. This is plus two regarding the brightness mode. And they're going to reduce it. Right, this is a plus one. And I'm going to take it down to zero. Brightness is now on zero for comparison. And I'll take it down to minus one, see what happens. Right, this is now minus one. I seem to cut through a lot of that light pollution. It's nowhere near as bad. But with the naked eye, it's appalling. <laughs> All I can see is the Great Bear, the seven main stars. Can't see any of the others. Put his camera up and count. Probably about 80 stars. Maybe a hundred. Right, looking through this viewfinder, I've switched on the green grid mode and I can use the grid to line up a star and keep it nice and steady. I'll give an example, if I just line up Mars on Alcor on one corner of a square, there. Can I keep it steady? Almost as good as a tripod. And this is handheld. Okay, we'll line back in our deck chair. There's another satellite. But without the grid, it could wobble all over the place. <laughs> there goes the satellite. Let's see how steady I can get it if I put uh, the plane on the, the grid. Oh, I not the oh yeah, oh blimey, look at that. Oh, that is bright. My goodness. Oh my word! Wow, well spotted. That is the brightest flare I've ever seen. <laughs> wow! My goodness, that was stunning, wasn't it? Wow, that was really something else. I have to look that one up, it's 11.15pm.